hello everyone uh, hope you are doing well uh, we have machine here over here mf8080 cw uh, today i'm going to show you how to scan with the automatic document feeder and uh, directly into the pen drive uh, so stay with me watch the complete video to see the steps and uh, you can see my other tutorial about this machine uh, in another video you can find in the link in the description so in this video i will explain how to scan directly without using your computer uh, directly files it with pdf format to the pen drive first of all i will connect i have one flash drive and i will connect uh, in the usb port here okay this is connected and first of all uh, basically this model is mf8080 cw and there is the same different model is M mf8040 8020 have the same function will apply so i upload the loaded the paper here that i will scan in the pdf format with automatic document feeder to the pen drive here is the steps you have to press the scan button okay so it's asking the options here you can see in the screen computer remote scanner memory media okay so i will select the memory media okay it's asking the options here scan size a4 yes we have a4 i uploaded it file format pdf destiny plus minus zero original portrait so uh, if you want to change this pdf to jpg you can select it from here if you want to uh, change because uh, scan in the pdf format leave it as it is so i will leave it as it is and i will press ok file format pdf uh, okay fine so just we have to press the scan button it will start the scan process you can see paper are loaded in the uh, automatic document feeder i will okay you can see here i press the start button you can see the message here scanning okay you can see here stored folder number scan hyphen zero zero uh, the pdf two files are stored in one pdf file uh, this is the this process i explained to directly save into the pen drive so another uh, if there is another uh, you have file you want to save into your computer same process will apply you can uh, save it to your computer directly and you can have to install one application in the computer hope you guys uh, find this video useful if you have any question you can ask me in the comment box take care bye